That's all I'm saying. Do you guys think? Do you guys think it's a game? Of course, it's a fucking game. No, I'm saying, I'm saying, like, the information that you choose to to consume is a game within the the realms of rappers, street shit, like. Is Bro. that a game? Like I give you an example, right? Because oh, okay, everybody's yeah. so cap, right? Oh, okay, go ahead. Give you an example. Shy Blizzy. Do you still listen to him? No. Do you still listen to him? I've never listened to him. I've never listened to him. You heard White Girl. I've only listened to it because Shorty was in the video. And I was like, that that's was cap, bro. That was the first time I've that's heard cap. You telling me? You telling me back in 2011, 2012, you wasn't playing no, Shy Blizzy? No, like, if he wasn't saying, on the song uh, with uh, what's his name? That's what he's saying right now. He's going crazy right now. He's saying the that shit. I'm not. I'm not willingly. Distance, not, distance, not yourself. Willingly, what's the song distance yourself. Distance yourself. What's the song from Shy Blizzy? Other than that white girl song. I don't know. He was on the song with uh the black dude with the nose ring. I don't know. You talking about some? He talking about crew? No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talking about the song Crew. That's the only thing I know about. Gold Link? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gold Link. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nigga, that shit is new as hell. We not talking no, that's about. That's not new as hell. What? That's not new. The song with Gold Link? That's not new. That's not, that's not prime new? Shy Glizzy, bro. What's, what's new? That's, that's what's re- new? That's, that's okay, shit. So re- that's that shit resurrected his career. Song from prime Shy Glizzy. Bro, I don't remember all that shit, bro. Nigga, that's like telling me to. That's like telling me to to say five uh, five low key like uh cheap key songs from when he first started. Huh? This song is like five, six years old. No, it's not. It's not five, six years old. Crew? Yeah. It's not five, yes, six years old. Yes, it is, bro. Bro, look at that. came out like 2016, 2017. You lying. 2018. Crew. Gold Link. Bro, that shit was the first That's song to go. years ago. 2016. Shy Glizzy came out 2011, 2012. His start, his, his hits. I mean, clearly just searched up, so search up Shy Glizzy. Oh. I'm saying his hits came from 2011, 2012. But what I'm saying, okay, go just say your point. I'm saying that, I'm saying, so, this is why I'm saying this shit matters, right? To rap niggas, and not everyone is cap. Shy Glizzy, when he first started rapping, he was, he was reportedly supposed to be with CMG. Do you know about this? Continue. With Yo Gotti? I don't know. Alright, so basically, he supposed to be with Yo Gotti. Yo Gotti's taking him on tour. This is when Shy Clizzy was just, he's having his breakout hits. He's the first nigga from Philly. He's coming out the same time as Keith. Then he's going in, and then the nigga Meek Mill sees him. And mind you, they, this is the, the, all these niggas in the streets right now. Meek Mill sees him. He puts him, in his, he puts him on game. He says, nigga, you from Philly. You supposed to be doing this, this, and this. Matter of fact, let me sign you. Whole time, he's already been around these Memphis niggas. He's already been around CMG. He's already been early Yo Gotti. So then he books, he's booking his shows. He's doing his little tours. This by himself after he just did all this credibility from Yo Gotti. Then he takes that. He takes a tour in Memphis. Memphis niggas. They end up. He doesn't know who these niggas is. They tell these niggas he's supposed to figure out. They want to tap in with him. He like, why the fuck should I tap in with you? Who is you niggas? Who do y'all be with? Who like what? How should I know you rap niggas? This this this. So he didn't give a fuck about that shit. So he went. He went to a show. He ended up losing his chain. They ended up taking the chain. The nigga, you know who who niggas those was? Them niggas was with Black Youngster. That was that was Black Youngsters people. So because he didn't tap in, because he didn't give a fuck about who he, who niggas be with, he ended up losing his chain. When Black Youngster got that chain, he put it on camera that he got that bitch back with Yo Gotti's blessing and all this shit. Then that shit ended up trans all all your Shy Glizzy's fame, all Shy Glizzy's attention ended up transferring to Black Youngster, and that's when Black Youngster rose to fame. That's why niggas don't know much about Shy Glizzy. That's why he faded out of existence. So what I'm trying to say is, to rap niggas, it matters. To civilians, it don't matter. Because if you want, if you don't care about that shit as a rap nigga, you end up in situations like Shy Glizzy. You could be the you could be the streetest nigga. You could be tapped so, in all that so, shit, so but you're gonna point, end up in situations like that. So to my point is, I guess yeah. If if rapper to rapper is talking about to each other, say where are you from, and then someone says I'm from the south side of Chicago, it's like okay, yeah. So you must know the people that I know from the south side of Chicago. Hey, point blank, period. That's it. I'm just saying. Also, so what I'm saying. So what I'm saying is nothing is wrong with that. I'm just saying. I'm just saying that overall, it outside of that that scenario that you literally just talked about, niggas don't care. That's what I'm saying. Who's don't care? Listen to what I said. <laughs> Listen to what I said. You said niggas outside, don't care outside of the scenario that you just said. Uh huh. 
Niggas do not care. Who is these niggas? I'm talking about humans. Who is these humans? Everybody. Civilians. Metropolitan, suburban, outside day walkers. Of the people outside of the situation that you just put in, and I'm really holding my tongue from saying something about <laughs> niggas, but <laughs> I'm just letting that's niggas that's know right it, now, bro. Man. Like that shit really matters because although we talking about rap shit, I just gave you a street. That was a street story. Like that's, that's a street what, shit. But, but I'm saying, like that's what I'm saying. Like if it's not street. Then it does not matter. That's Majority what and 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 this is the thing too, right? So niggas is having this conversation about rap versus street in my head, because after Keith, rap and street became the same thing. Before Keith, it was rap and the streets. After Keith, it's, it's just not. It's that's why you gotta have. That's why you gotta. That's why these things matter to rappers. So so going to Tupac and Diggy area, that was two different things. Bro, I don't niggas, think it's counting that hair. I don't think you can. Because, I mean, I was literally about to say what he just said. But if you're talking about the era of hip-hop, okay. like, after right. Kanye 50, no, 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 into no. Keith, then no. yeah, that street shit no, did no, not no. matter. Nah, bro. All right. Let me, let me, all right. What, what game was Biggie part of? I don't know the facts. I just remember, what? How I was he remember, banging? I just remember yeah, that shit was West Tupac versus the whole East. industry. That shit was West versus East. <laughs> I know, but who was banging? Huh? Tupac or Biggie? Yeah, I mean, you don't know because nigga, the, we not talking about the. I'm telling you right now, so rap this, and streets has is, is always been separated. They have never been the same thing. Niggas is shooting at the police, nigga. You know yeah, the niggas but, that are cold and ratchet. But fuck you talking about. <laughs> but with the Tupac and Biggie, it was <laughs> you know the niggas that it was West them. West Side versus East. That's side. not that nigga. I mean, West Coast versus East nigga, Coast. Nigga, Biggie and Pac was mascots, nigga. They mascots for the streets. Nigga, they not the street niggas. They the niggas. They the niggas that go to the studio. They've been around all these street niggas. Ice Cube, Biggie, all these niggas. P Diddy, all the niggas, bro. They niggas has been around the street niggas. They go into the studio. They rap about what their friends did. They rap about what their friends saw. They rap about the stories that they've been told. Nigga, they not doing the shit. They not committing the crimes. Biggie and Pac getting shot was some whole deeper shit so what than about, them. What about the game in Fifty? The game in Fifty. Them Damn. niggas wasn't. Them niggas was beefing as rappers. No, what I'm saying is them was niggas was beefing niggas. as rappers. That was street niggas that turned into rappers. Nigga, they was street niggas, but they wasn't talking, bro. They wasn't talking about niggas' ops in the songs, bro. They wasn't in this bitch shooting at each other and then going to do a diss track and then taking one of theirs and they come taking one of theirs. These niggas is from opposite sides and they they literally rapping about shit because of Biggie and Pop. What the fuck are we talking about? So what about Gucci and uh? Ice man, bro, that shit, that shit wasn't, nigga. Gucci wasn't even out here like that, bro. Like that's the real story, bro. That's the real story, bro. <laughs> Sound like even two KO examples to me. I'm trying to tell but you, anyway, but anyway. you, you talking about like Gucci and Walker? Nah, nigga, I'm talking about Gucci and I don't even know who Ice Man Jeezy. is. Jeezy, I don't even know. I don't even know nothing about that. Shorty Low. Put that boy in the dirt. <laughs> you talking about Pookie Love? Put that boy in the dirt. Pookie Love? I mean, shit, That's I all about know. the bullshit. <laughs> Pookie Love? I nigga. guess. Nigga, I guess. Nigga. Yeah. nigga, I'm trying hey, to hey, tell bro. niggas, bro. <laughs> I'm trying to tell niggas, bro. Nigga, the nigga just Man, said Pookie hey. Love. What the fuck is he really talking about? <laughs> nigga, that's his name. I know. Exactly. But I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is we talking Civilian about? Civilian Cam. Civilian Cam. Civilian cam. Motherfuckers just gave LA Civilian cam. Yeah. Hey, can yeah. you put an effect on that? Hey. When y'all went on there and then like put like you something. I got how I be in the, uh, how I be on like that, uh, in the stadiums and shit. Mm-hmm. Civilian cam. Yo, I'm trying to tell niggas, bro. There was no, there was, bro, until Keith and them came around, bro. Niggas did not tell Nick, Nick, bro. Keith, the, Keith decoded the blueprint on how to put the streets in music, bro. These niggas wasn't talking about shit, bro. These niggas wasn't talking about shit, bro. At all, bro. Game 50 Cent. What the fuck was they talking about, nigga? You just know they got, they got fucking beef. And they in songs taking little shots. Nigga, I, niggas is putting joke. Niggas put Tuka in a song, nigga. What the fuck we talking about, nigga? That's violent as fuck. Niggas ain't never put nobody in a song, bro. Hey, I'm not no hip-hop historian. I just know general things about hip-hop. So... 
They probably got their own versions of Tuka. I don't. I don't. No, know. they don't, don't bro. Know. They don't, bro. These listening. niggas literally said hip hop was never this dangerous. I'm the niggas saying. you talking about literally said hip hop was never this if, dangerous. If Biggie and Tupac died, <laughs> they didn't kill each other though. Who did? The niggas around them. This thing is stupid, bro. <laughs> what the fuck? If you don't get it, you don't get it. King bro. Von murdered Duck. Nigga, what the fuck we talking about? I'm two rappers, nigga. No. If you don't get it. <laughs> if you don't get it. Hey, I ain't gonna lie to what you. What are you talking bro? about, bro? What the fuck is we talking about? <laughs> <laughs> it's a million cam. Hey, nah, put, that's put a bad, cam, bro. Put this because, a million cam, bro. Because this is, a wild, this is wild. Like, put this a million cam, Like, bro. think about it, bro. Niggas, niggas talking about names, they, dropping names and shit. And nigga, it's like, public record, bro. It's public record. Bro, they murdered that nigga on fucking on, yes, on Gold crazy. Coast, bro. <laughs> they put that man in the dirt on Gold Coast, so, bro. Where's so Gun Jam? Von put Honey K on his head. Honey yeah, Pat. We can change. Honey Bun. We can change topics. Like, bro, what are you <laughs> talking about? about? All right, bro. Check this what? out. It's check like, this out, bro. It's like, okay, like, you want to change topics or you want to stay on the topic? Because I can go. Von did it himself. No, he put a honey pack on him. What does that mean? He put a honey bun on his head. What does that mean? He put money on his head. What does that mean? He got him killed. What does that mean? Vaughn <laughs> is the reason FBG Duck got murdered. What does that mean? Because he, he had his niggas attack him? BDs and GDs? Nigga, Vaughn Von would have killed him himself. Okay. Vaughn got 10 bodies. We can change something. So I'm sorry about this shit no more. Vaughn would have killed him himself. Vaughn without being next to Dirk, he would have. Come on now. 